it was just about um, staying on track to figure out the first step, second step to get them to safety. With immediate family in Ukraine, immediate action was taken by Michelle Dandigzal. The 27-year-old left her home in Montreal and made her way to Slovakia, which shares borders with Ukraine, to help her grandmother, cousins and friends flee the Russian invasion. We realized more and more of our immediate family had to escape and they didn't have a choice. Um, and when I realized that I could help more while being there, uh, especially with documents and translations and everything that they need to do um, just past getting the border. Um, I went there and I was able to help them with that. Before moving to Montreal with her family in 2000, Zal spent her childhood in Ukraine. Her initial reaction to the invasion, shock. But getting her loved ones to safety was top of mind. Her mother left Quebec first and she followed days later. If you're here on the nearby or in any country it's it's very similar just supporting and helping as much as possible. Zal's sister in the United States is also doing her part from afar, holding rallies in her community and collaborating with friends across the world to help Ukrainians seek safety. The Ukrainian culture, um, Ukrainian people, the community, the spirit is so strong that every little bit um, helps and we need to continue the efforts even though it's been a whole month it's only been a month so we need to keep keep our efforts and keep our spirits strong the sisters getting to see each other during our interview zoom call was emotional due to time difference and humanitarian efforts they haven't had time to speak other than on text evan says she is especially proud of her sister's courage i'm proud of her um knowing that we have I mean, immediate family that was uh, that left Ukraine and we were able to help evacuate them into a neighboring country. Now that Zell's family and friends are safe, her father, he has been driving people out of Ukraine to safety. And like many, she and her sister have taken to the Internet to raise funds for other Ukrainian families in need. In about a week, I'm planning to come back home. Okay. But I hope to do as much as I can in this time. In Montreal, Pamela Pagano, City News.